vehicle is pitching downrange. The U.S. Federal Aviation Administration has grounded SpaceX's Falcon 9 rocket, according to the agency on Wednesday. It follows a failure of a routine landing attempt during a Starlink mission, and this marks the second time the FAA has grounded SpaceX this year. It may also delay SpaceX's Polaris Dawn mission, which plans to send four private astronauts on the first commercial spacewalk. On Wednesday morning, the rocket successfully launched Starlink satellites into orbit from Florida. But when it attempted to land on a barge, the rocket fell into the ocean after a fiery touchdown. Two, one. Falcon 9 rockets are essential for launching satellites and people into space, so groundings are rare. The last time was July, when a second stage failure lost a batch of Starlink satellites. No satellites or people were in danger during Wednesday's flight, but the landing failure suggests a problem with the rocket that the FAA believes could pose a risk in future missions if not properly investigated. The Polaris Dawn mission was already delayed twice this week over a helium leak and bad weather. In late September, Falcon 9 is also set to launch two NASA astronauts on a Crew Dragon spacecraft. The same mission is set to eventually bring home two astronauts stranded on the International Space Station, who arrived on Boeing's troubled Starliner craft. NASA oversees Falcon 9 for its missions, but it's unclear how the latest grounding will affect them. Since its first launch in 2010, SpaceX has built a large fleet of reusable Falcon boosters, enabling it to launch more frequently than its competitors. The booster that failed on Wednesday was on its 23rd flight.